And so here it is in verse 20. It says, God blessed them and said to them, Be fruitful and increase in number. Fill the earth and, and, and subdue it. it. Fill the earth and subdue it. Now, to subdue something, it means to overcome, to quieten, or bring under control. God made a mandate over his people, over the earth, to overcome it, to quiet it, and to bring it under control. Failed. And so when Jesus came, he told us in John 16, 33, I have told you these things so that in me you may have peace, and in this world you will have trouble, but take heart, I have overcome the world. See, because we couldn't do it, we didn't do it, Jesus had to come to do it. And so because Jesus came to do it, now we are restored back in the place where we were in the Garden of Eden. In the Greek, the word witness is martis, which means uncertain affinity. Uncertain affinity. And to summarize what that means, it means it's a similarity of characteristics suggesting a relationship Especially a resemblance of something or someone whom you cannot physically identify with, with certainty. So, so I'm a witness. I cannot identify with Christ with certainty what he looks like. But there's a resemblance within me that if you knew who Christ was for yourself, you should be able to see the Christ in me. Yeah. And because I know how Christ is and I know who Christ is in me, I can see the resemblance of Christ in you. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. And now people that have not seen us or have not seen him can get a glimpse of, I've never seen Jesus before, but there's something different about yes. you. Yes. There's something peculiar yes. about you. Yes. There's something about you that makes me drawn to you. But the reality is they're not being drawn to you. They're being drawn to the Jesus in you. So I don't have to go and beat you upside the head with a Bible. I just need to live right. That's right. He knew it was more beneficial to speak to the problem yeah. than to speak about the problem. Yeah. So when we're joint heirs with Christ, we learn that there's some things that you just don't entertain. Yeah. I, I'm not going to panic and try to figure my way out of this one. Because, see, all I got to do is really just do like Jesus did. I'm just going to rest. Now, and in my rest, if the storm doesn't want to come on its own, if the storm wants to try to become bigger and greater, if the storm is just sitting right over me and it's trying to bring fear, now I can come out of my rest and speak to it. Yes. Okay, you've been here long enough. Yeah. Peace. Be still. Come on. Come on. Come on.